Welcome back to City Grill. My name is Rob Ford, and in this episode, uh, it's going to be frozen hamburgers. Yeah, frozen hamburgers. Uh, believe it or not, restaurants do this all the time. I worked at a several several restaurants growing up as a teenager, and basically, you pull a hamburger out of the freezer and stick it on the grill. You can do the same thing at home. It's quick and easy. So I've got the grill already heated up at 350, 400 degrees. It's really hot right there, and I have two frozen hamburgers. Right. So I'm just gonna place them on the grill, just like so, pull off the wrapping. And the real key here is just doing a little seasoning right now while they're still frozen, right on top. So I'll put some sea salt on it, just like so. A little fresh ground pepper. You could season this with onion powder, any, anything you choose, really. There's some good uh, sauce to put on called Dale sauce at the restaurant, or not restaurants, but actually at the grocery stores. And uh, I like the uh, garlic and pepper seasoning, and I'll just load that on there pretty thick right now. And we'll cook these for at least seven minutes on high heat directly over the burners until we start to see the juices form on the top. Once we see those juices, we'll flip them until we see the juices on the other side. All right, it's been seven to ten minutes. 400. 350 degrees, 400 degrees, that's been variable a little bit. I've turned it up and down a little bit as it's been cooking. So we'll take a look. That's what we want to see. We want to see those juices on that hamburger right there. That looks beautiful, right like that. So I'll go ahead and flip these. Nice grill marks on them. And we'll go ahead and season them one more time on the other side. So we'll put a little black pepper on there, just like so. A little sea salt and my favorite is the garlic salt and uh, black pepper and we'll douse that pretty good just like so those will be delicious we'll let that juices flow back up to the top again and they're ready all right it's been another 10 minutes let's take a look the burgers look beautiful look See that juice coming out of the burger right there? It's plenty of juice. That means it's a perfect medium rare. It's ready to come off the grill. Now, if you want cheese, like uh, my daughter likes cheese on hers, so I'm going to go ahead and put some cheese on that. She's recording this for us, and uh, mine's ready, but I'll, I'll bring it over here a little bit further towards the end because it's a little bit cooler in that spot. I'll bring down the heat on my side, and I'll go ahead and cover this and let the cheese melt, and these are ready to go. And that's it for a frozen hamburger. You know, 20 minutes at the most, and you're ready to eat. So, uh, if you would, subscribe to my YouTube channel, City Grilling, and get the recipe at citygrilling.com. Actually, there's no real recipe to this, you just saw it right here, but I'll put something out there for you.